Hey everybody, this is Christine and my cat Montague. Welcome to the Shopping Therapy Couch. So today we are going to do a Dollar Tree haul. So if you're into it, sit back, relax, take your troubles to the door and do some shopping therapy with us. Okay, so as Monty's giving himself a bath, we're going to start on the haul. So anyway, uh, reviews and repurchases usually happen first in my videos. So let's get started with some yummy stuff. And my daughter usually uh, picks out some yummy treats for her dad, which is usually gummy bears. And that's what we did. So we've got some of these horrible dinosaurs. So there you go. There's some gummies there. And we usually get uh, a couple packages, but this week we decided to switch it up. And we got some chocolate along with the gummies. So we got some old reliable Snickers. I know you can probably get a better value at your grocery store, but you know what? We were we were there, so we picked some up. And also they had these um, flips. They are milk chocolate covered pretzels. And there is your stats if you're interested in it. So it's not too much, but I'm hoping they're delicious. Uh, my little one, she uh, saw the sucker display and so of course I melted and I did end up getting her one of these uh, suckers and it looks like it's some kind of orange and white or oh there we go, orange creamsicle. There you go, so I bet you that's going to be delicious. Okay, so some practical things, so just ended up getting some heavy du duty scouring pads so this is just restocking the pantry got some quart bags freezers so these are pretty much a staple uh, in the household so got those and some fresh cup coffee filters and they do the job just fine for me and all the uh, coffee addicts so there you go uh, stocking up on that stuff they actually had really good displays for their bath and body. Although for the majority of them, I wasn't, I couldn't either smell them or I wasn't into the scent. So the, the selection was much, much, much bigger than what I'm showing here. So anyway, let's start with some bath bombs. And this one is pink pineapple cucumber, if that'll ever focus. And then it has beautiful on it and all these come with three little bath bombs and there's your stats on that this one is lovely you in the mango hibiscus and then we have the good vibes with the lavender eucalyptus so there you go beautiful packaging it's almost like a marble-ish kind of thing uh, they also had some body washes I picked up two of them even though I'm not crazy about the packaging itself like the design is beautiful I just don't like this part like I wish it was like a pump or whatever but you know what that's that's all that they had and I'll just um, put it in a different container anyway because like when you open it it just tends to, for me, I'm not fast enough, so it tends to get all over the place. But look at how beautiful that packaging is. That would be great in a gift basket, actually. But this one is in lavender and jasmine. And I got a second one here that is in pink uh, cactus and aloe. And a zoom out here. If Actually, Monty's a good contrast here. So <laughs> this one is like a, like a pink color there. And there you go. There's focus. There you go. There's the stats on those guys if you're interested. And then they had a bunch of shimmer sprays. Like I said, they must have had like possibly even eight of them, but uh, I wasn't into the scents, but I was into this one. So this one is the shimmer body mist and then it really does smell like pineapple this thing smells so good so anyway there it's the stats on that and actually because i noticed that you know even though it's packaged like that you can still like kind of unscrew it which defeats the packaging but anyway i'm just gonna try this out that's how i could get in there and smell a lot of them 
Whew, that's like pretty strong. All right, so I don't know if you guys can see. Okay, well, it's kind of like a want want on the on the shimmer. It doesn't it doesn't shimmer at all, but it smells good. It smells really good. All right. <laughs> On to the next thing. So they had some new faux nails, and I just loved them. One design was is kind of coming in at like, you know it's kind of midsummer now, so uh, I'll have to use these quickly. So there is the flamingos, and I just thought that was really pretty with the pale pink. This one's by Sassy and Chic, and they call them their fashion nails. So we got this one. And they had some beautiful pearlized ones. And I wish you guys could see them in person because I don't think this is going to translate well. And I was thinking, well, maybe I could have gotten two of them. But I have, um, you know, the real, like, real nail polish that actually looks like that. But I just thought that was so pretty. And I can, like, when I do my nails, I could just never get the finish on them like, like, like a fake nail. So, anyway got that one and then I ended up getting two of these because I thought these were so gorgeous okay so hopefully the glare is not that bad so anyway you could see that there is some some glittery accent nails and then it has kind of like that cheetah print and then they have these pale pink ones there so I thought that was a beautiful set and like I said I liked it so much I got two of them and besides that like some sometimes the the nails actually don't fit and so you almost need a second set to make it you know complete on your nails so or on your hand so okay and then now moving into the back to school stuff like I've seen other halls and they just are full like their stores are full but ours aren't like for some reason they they just have like pens and markers i mean it wasn't even that great of a selection so but they did have some of the notebooks so i got this oh i'm sorry <laughs> i'm like i jabbed them so anyway so i got this notebook and i have been into the b design this year i think they are doing an excellent job with that so anyway there is some cute designs in the notebook as you can see there it coordinates with the uh, outside here and of course here it says uh, busy bee so I was into that I thought that was so cute and I couldn't believe that I found this one too it's uh, some happy planner stickers and at first I thought this was like a whole stack stuck together but it really was one thing so as you can see that you get over 1500 stickers this thing is like a really great size it comes with a little elastic band there and it is it's the it says seasonal and it is so pretty so i'm just gonna so there's like summer and then you got i mean just all the holidays like okay there you go fall Halloween Christmas there you go so anyway I just thought that was such a good find it really was I mean anyway so hopefully I will actually use it instead of talking about it but time will tell all right so the last couple things in my haul so we're in the countdown to my daughter's birthday party so she's gonna have a dinosaur theme um, I know I've covered this um, in my past hauls I'm just working my way up to it and I hope I'm gonna come from the other way because the glare is so bad so anyway this one is so as you can see there it says saving you can, <laughs> hi you can see me in the corner <laughs> so it says saving for a dinosaur there is you can't really see but it's like has a gold border on it and then of course the hole on top so I thought you know maybe that would be a good uh, table decoration and then she uh, maybe I'll put some like like I my sister and her kids they call it big faces so it's like the 50 cent coins the dollar like you know the bigger um, 
the bigger coins so maybe i'll stick a couple of those uh bigger guys like the dollars or the coin dollars or whatever in there so anyway so i thought that was cool and then i know it's a another food item but i was thinking about doing her cake and so i got some ice cream cones so i we really don't eat ice cream cones so i was thinking uh maybe I don't know what these look like yet, like how big they are, but there is 12. So um, I'm trying not to waste stuff too much, but I was thinking about turning these guys upside down and maybe chopping off the end and making these into uh, volcanoes on her on her cake. So I don't know. That's just an idea. So I'll, I'll have to break it open and, and test it out on some, on, you know, when I'm decorating. So anyway, that is it for the haul. I hope you enjoyed it. Sorry about that. He took a bath over the whole thing. But anyway, so I hope you guys had have a great weekend. And we will see you all the next time. All right. Bye-bye.